friend and we're drifting out to sea. It's been roughly three hours. Still no rescue at all whatsoever. Hopefully someone comes and gets us soon. What are you doing? I think that thing oh my God. Well, Slayers, today was going to be an awesome, epic day and Slay here out in the deep blue. But today, we're stranded. Thank God I brought my ACR. We're waiting for the Coast Guard. As you can see, my boy over here is waving for help. The lower unit of our outboard looks like most likely snap while we're running out to go ahead and catch some tuna and some dolphin. So, uh, well, hopefully someone finds us. And whoever finds us, I am Joey Slam. Please let my parents know. Hopefully that doesn't happen or anything, but uh, but I hope they come because we're stranded. Hello. If I need help. As you can see, it's it's a big deal. I'm trying to keep cool and kind of panicking and stuff. Yeah, like we're gonna take care of our fish. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, this is it's 10:32, Friday, June. Um, what is it? June 7th. I think so. I think it's June 7th, guys. So we got battery on the phones and everything like that. We'll document everything and uh, we'll be back in a hour or two and fill you in on what's going on. Alligator reef from boat is stranded. We're drifting out to sea. We need Coast Guard man. Our boat is stranded. It's not so it looks like he got some reception. We're good. I'm laughing. I'm hold, nervous. Hold, okay, hold together. We have service. We're doing good, guys. We're, we have everything here. We got some water and everything. Guys, we're going to be fine. We have water. We have, like drinking water. We have Tobo USA. We have crackers. Called Tobo USA. It's okay, Lily. It's gonna be okay. Someone hug my What's the GPS location? GPS location is? Okay, it says 24 degree 49 period 026 north, and then the west is gonna be 08028366. Yeah, this is, this is real. We're not messing around. We're actually stranded. I wish I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I mean, we're ready to slay and everything. But I have this thing. Yeah, 0.366. So Slayers, like I was saying, we have everything we need to survive, worst case. But right now we do have contact with land to get possibly a, a tow boat. I have my little ACR thing here, ready to go for the Coast Guard. This is pretty spooky. There's, 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 yeah, there's a boat all the way out there. I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah, there's a boat. Yeah, we got everything we can do. I mean, we got a horn and everything, beep beep. Um, yeah, we're, we're trying to keep it together, you know what I'm saying? It's, this is kind of a serious situation, even though we're trying to have a good time too and stay positive. It's all about staying positive out here. This is not stage at all. I mean, I can turn on the engine and try to show it. It looks like it's the lower half unit snapped and the boat is stuck in neutral. Whether we go forward in gear or reverse, we're stuck. So keep it together. We're good. We're good. We'll be fine. At least we'll be 10. I love you. We got food and pineapples and strawberries. We won't starve. Sun's getting to you. Laugh. Laugh. Yeah, sun's getting to us right now. It's getting kind of crazy. I ain't listening though. Yeah, bro. No, no, no. <laughs> He's vibing. We're good. We're not fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, stay positive. Yeah, stay positive. Yeah, stay positive. Yeah, stay positive. <laughs> might as well. Uh, might as well try to go ahead and catch something. Yeah, get. Yeah, just drop something down. No, no, yeah, we do. Just catch something, get some dinner, you know, let it bake out here and it'll probably cook, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna throw it up anyway, I'm so sick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just sit up. You gotta sit up. You can't be laying down. Come on, come, girl. Come. No. Well, I don't want to say. It's getting really hard. I'm tired. I'm about to start checking some stuff off. We got what we need, though, to make it out here. At least, at least two days worth of food. So, hopefully, that doesn't happen and we can make it out safely and. Oh man, yeah, I'm starting to pack now. I'm really starting to panic. David, have you done for some eating you? Oh yeah. Like yeah, those, chi those, those chicken legs look pretty good, boy. Mm. Yeah, bro, 100%. Yeah. You're, really? We got birds out here. Oh, uh, I can't even. I can't even focus, guys. These guys are fishing, and we're like super stranded. Like I don't know. There's no sense of urgency here. We seriously need to be rescued. There's zero sense of urgency. They said they were coming an hour ago. We're drifting away from land and we're losing reception. We don't have a VHF radio on the boat. That's my concern. Coast Guard seems Verizon to have no sense of urgency. MVP. I'm about to change to no Verizon after today. Verizon is insane. I love AT&T, but Verizon is here. 
it wasn't for Geo right there, we would have no contact with society yes, right now. And our coordinates right now. We're still waiting for Togo Let USA. Me give you my in case Everything. Of you okay? North. Two no. four degrees. Five yeah, one. We're, we're cooking. It's and never happened. We're before. cooking out here. We've been adrift for over an hour. We're drifting away from land because they're not sending anybody to help us. It's been two hours now. I'm sorry. So I'll check in soon. Oh yeah, sorry. Our engine does update. It's been roughly three hours. Still no rescue at all whatsoever. Hopefully some come, someone comes and gets us soon. This is out of this world, guys. Been out here for three, four hours stranded. It is it's really hot and everything, and I'm just trying to, I'm just actually just trying to survive, you know? There's a plane. Fortunately, I doubt the plane can go ahead and see us out there. Yeah, we're all frustrated, I understand. But, uh, we gotta stay positive, guys. Oh my God, we got someone to come by and save us. Oh my God, this is amazing, finally. Oh my God, we've been out here. Dude, this is amazing. We have been stranded for over four hours out here. No hope, this is honestly a dream come true, guys. Hi, how's it going? Hi, sir. We've been stranded for four hours. We've been stranded for four hours. We called the Coast Guard and everything, and we're still waiting on them. Our outboard gave out. Lower unit stopped working. Right now he's calling, as you can see. He's radioing the Coast Guard, verifying that we are not any pirates or anything. I know, babe. It's been rough. I know. I'm sorry. It's been out of this world. It's been a really tough day. Honestly, our fishing trip was completely ruined by this unfortunate event, guys. This is a lot to deal with right now. It's really been literally four hours. So thanks to this gentleman out here. He's out here calling the US Coast Guard to verify everything. Our day is finally saved and we no longer have to cook out here in this terrible sun. I mean, we have water, but we've been drinking a lot, sharing it around. And that's pretty much what we all love, so it's been wild. What's the word? That's him out there? Oh, that's him? God. No way. Oh my God, that's him. That's Boat US. We really appreciate you guys. I almost lost my phone. All righty. Wow. So Appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you so much. Hey, Have a great one. Take care. Home. God bless. We love you so much. Do we love you? Oh, Respect the senior citizens for they are the ones that saved us. There is Boat US, guys. Our hero that took us 20 hours to get. I'm exaggerating, but the sun is absolutely blistering. It's burning us. Look at that. It's burning. Salvation. Finally. Sal freaking Vation. Wow. What do you need us to do? Hey, rather go than no go. <laughs> Might as well. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna go ahead. Hey, you know what? Y'all troll. I I'm gonna go to sleep with Libby. Might as well. Jeez Louise. Four hours later. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and have this guy tow us all the way back home. Guys, I'm glad we went ahead and persevered. We made it through it. You're the man, Gio. Without Verizon, we would have not been able to do it, bro. Yeah, oh, and then also, we also had this beautiful thing, this rescue link. Worst case, we had a helo coming for us, but we wanted to stay strong at both US. The Hilo honestly would have been one of the most epic things we would have ever had, but unfortunately this is no joke, this is no laughing matter guys. This is serious, this happens to a lot of people, people get stranded. I made a joke one time, we're catching more fishing that I got stranded where I was really just away from the world and I came back, but it's a serious thing guys, it's something not to play with and we're gonna go ahead and get hooked, hooked up with this guy and hopefully we'll make it home sooner rather than later. We're out here now. Oh, we're moving, sweet. This is amazing. So, final update, guys. Four hours later, we are heading home. Hey, you want a fillet? So, guys, on the way back, we decided to go ahead and put out a troll. And we're hooked up. Put us out of gear for a second to pick this thing in. <laughs> this drag going? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're hooked up, guys. Get them in, boy. Get them in. Wind. Wind, wind, wind. Don't stop. Get that thing in there. 
Wine, 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 wine. Was this on that big X wrap? Yes, sir. Oh my God. So it might be decent. It might be a sandwich. We do need a little something after surviving out here in the wild. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Get them in. Wine that thing. Don't stop. Oh, it's a whole bunch of salad, guys. Salad. Caesar salad Caesar for Caesar. dinner. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to have to pass on the salad. That thing was whooping your butt, boy. Finally, guys. Civilization. We are almost home. Back at the boat ramp. The longest trip ever we survived. Hey, guys. Couldn't have done it without you flares and everything and everybody out there sending your prayers. You know, God's... <laughs> God's amazing, he kept us safe and we're finally on our way home to go ahead and just be able to relax and take a breath and understand what the heck just went down today. Slayers, I wanna go ahead and apologize for the wind, but finally, we made it. Land ho, land freaking ho. Never thought I'd see the day again, huh? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, man, we appreciate you. It was crazy, crazy day out there. What's up? We're on land. Three freaking years. To be honest. We made it, guys. We made it. Journey. journey. All right, Slayers. So we made it back to land. We're safe. Mm -hmm. We're happy. I mean, I'm I'm kind of speechless. This is definitely a lesson learned. Now, yeah. what's very odd is I'm pretty proactive in making sure I have a plan. It's always recommended by the Coast Guard. You go ahead and have a plan on where you're to be, where you're to go. So luckily, I'm very adamant in doing that. And I always let friends and family know. Now, the real MVP, I'm not sponsored by them, but the real MVP is right here, is this. This thing right here is the real MVP. It hit up the Coast Guard, which goes ahead and relays and hits up my parents and my family members who are connected to this and friends as well. Yeah. And they were able to go ahead and make all the proper arrangements so that we were towed safely home. So I'm like, I'm still deranged. It's, it's been hot. This thing right here is a huge beacon that saved us. I recommend everyone have it. Yeah. You always gotta have everything that you need when you go. Pay attention, make sure everything's okay. Radios, the whole nine yards. Just, it's very important that you have what you need when you go out there to slay. Mm -hmm. It's not a game. You could be out there forever. Luckily, we had reception by the grace of God. Like, man, without God, we couldn't have made it out there. It's, it made no sense. We were 20 miles out and we had reception. No joke, you guys saw it. The raw footage and everything, mm -hmm. you guys saw we had connection. Then we go ahead and go in six miles, I have no reception. So, I mean, there's only one answer, man. I'm not here to preach anything to you guys or anything. But I'm just letting you know, J-Man loves me, loves her, loves all you guys. And they want to make sure that sometimes you got to take a moment and thank God for everything that's going on in your life. Because we could be stranded out there currently. You might not even be able to see this. We would, they would have found this video and I don't even know. We're really just taking like documentaries of what was going on out there. So it was pretty scary. It was honestly something that I've never wanted to experience again. And I'm always prepared almost always overly prepared so i always recommend even though whoever you're going out with whether it's your friends your families your cabin everything you know prepare yourself because worst case that happens you're always going to be prepared so slayers i love y'all appreciate the support everything you guys are doing the channel's flying let's get to 300,000, and i'll see you in the next adventure oh yeah